Um, it's Deserect. We're going to do another episode of Blow Out That Cartridge. And in the spirit of Konami side scrollers, we're going to be doing uh, Super Metroid today. So this one I'm a little bit better at than Super Castlevania 4. I think we'll be able to uh, play a good 10 or 15 minutes without me dying just as many times. No dying. So um, I'm going to start a new game here. And do we want English text or Japanese text? <laughs> it's always the question. I uh, I don't know if we're going to be able to handle the Japanese text, so let's go with English text. Yeah, we're not Japanese. So we should try and act like we are. We're not I'll that talk cool. Talk to the <laughs> I first battled the Metroids on planet Zebes. It was there that I foiled the plans of the space pirate leader, Mother Brain. I can't sustain that. Everybody uh, likes Brain. The space pirate leader, Mother Brain, to use the creatures to attack galactic civilization. That doesn't sound very nice. But he did meet Mother Brain. Have you ever played the original Metroid, Grant? Metroid oh, I forgot game. to introduce. I'm sorry. This is Graham um, again. Yeah. He was helping me on the last video. Only Metroid game that I played uh, was Metroid Fusion for the Game Boy Advance. No, that's a good one. And it was pretty solid. And I believe it was a remake, if I'm not mistaken. Um, I think it was originally on the SNES. I could it be might wrong. have been a remake of Super Metroid. I can't remember. It's been so long since I played that one. I don't. I don't remember which. Uh, I don't it's remember pretty, if enough of it is similar to call it a remake. Pretty excellent game. Oh, absolutely. Got Dude, I remember you and I times. back in the day um, sitting playing that and uh, Circle of the Moon like we talked about in the last video. Oh, yeah. You yeah like, we, gotta love Game Boy Advance was a great Man, great the double A batteries we burned through. Yeah. <laughs> Duracell had our number. Yeah, we, we used so many damn batteries. And the scientists' findings were astounding. They discovered that the powers of the Metroid might be harnessed for the good of civilization. Damn straight. We got this nice two-dimensional cutscene. With the little Metroid just kind of vibrating, you know, getting ready. Samus! Satisfied that all was well, I left the station to seek new bounty to hunt. But I had hardly gone beyond the asteroid belt when I picked up a distress signal. Ceres station was under attack! Indeed. I gotta say, the graphics in this game were great for when it came out. And the bosses were just these massive constructs that were terrifying. Oh, yeah. Big old spider boss, I remember that one. Yeah. It's a frightening one. Hard to, hard to defeat. Alright, so here we are. Let's look, I got, that's my shot, that's my jump. Alright, those are the two things I need. And I played Super Smash way back in the day. Super Smash sit for the 64, and man, I never knew Samus was a female. I never knew that. I was thinking about that actually when we booted up the game. The opening cutscene, I mean, you could kind of tell by her eyes when it showed them through her visor. But it's something that, again, if you're not looking for, you don't really pick up on. Same thing with that suit she's wearing. It's kind of feminine in build, but you don't really notice it. Oh god, there are dead people here. Dat Samus! Well, so far, no deaths. We're doing better than Super Castlevania. Yeah. And I will try to do another Super Castlevania video. I just make no promises. It's a tough what game. Do I, what do I do with this? You gonna... Uh-oh. I forgot about this guy. Ah! Noise, noise. He's, he's coming for me. He's got my number. And I can't it's... find a good place to put my camera, so it's sitting, like, on top of where I'm standing. Nice. Ow. Whatever you do, win the day. I'm trying. If you don't win the day, that'll be a problematic. It's an emergency. Let me out. Self-destruct's been activated. Let me out. Okay, I got a minute to get out of here. Nice. All right. 
We're booking it. We are booking it. Get out of there. I'm doing it. I always, I've never, and it's not this game's fault. Oh, I forgot about the steam coming out of those pipes. But I have never been a fan of time sequences in games. Norse. It just, it's, they're stressful to me. I get it. I mean, that's what they're there for, is to be stressful, but. True that. This part's the hard part. The screen starts tilting and shit. Ah! Oh, almost there. Oh god. The screen it's it's too tilted. So <laughs> tilted. <clears throat> Alright, I made it. Whew, that was close. Alright. The screen was so tilted and between my camera and the screen tilting I couldn't see myself at all. Well that's what happens. When you get video game vertigo. Video game vertigo, bruh. That's upsetting. What are you clicking on over there? What are you playing? I'm not clicking on anything. I hear clicking. Don't accuse me of premature clicking. Don't lie to me. Wouldn't do that. Stop lying to me. What are you playing? Don't lie to me, boy. <laughs> Talk to our viewers. I'm not clicking on anything. Well, fine. Clicking on your mom. You, already you know, know my words. mom. Yeah, I do. And you know if well, I were if I were to tell her. No, we're not gonna see, tell her. See, every anything. time he says all this stupid shit about my mom. No, I say she's a nice lady. You know, fun fact, he had a crush on my mom when we were kids. Ah. He totally did. He told me. And then mom draws. <laughs> gonna have to delete that part or Nope, I'll... it's staying in there. <laughs> no. You can't tell your mom that you have a gaming channel then. Oh, she doesn't care. Oh god. She really doesn't. I mean, I, I could tell her I have a gaming channel and she'd be like, oh, that's nice for you. <laughs> and you will go to jail. A lot. Oh, can't go through that way yet. I need to turn into a little power ball. Whee! Very strange. So, we're gonna go, I forget. You gotta jump to shoot down. <coughs> I'm almost over this cold, dude. I'm really excited. Nice. You get over that cold. Colds are no fun. No, they're really not. And I, I really do think it's allergies. Um, it's... Actually, the HR woman where I work told me her mom would bring her to give me some local honey, which I guess helps. I guess it's kind of immunizing yourself against local pollen. So I'm kind of excited about that. Cause... Honey from the teats. Mm. No, don't be gross. Shut up, you're gross. <laughs> so anyways, yes, so it, Samus is more prone to getting sick because it's in space where there is... Nothing. Mirrored diseases that we don't have here. A lot of them. <laughs> Just so many of them. But yeah, that's that's your fun science -y fact for the day. Yeah, you Local want... honey helps you get over a cold. Everybody knows that. Did everybody know that? I it's like know. on the Geico commercial. Yeah, everybody knows that. <laughs> oh, here's my little morph ball. Yeah, give me the morph ball. Freaking morph ball is out of control. Next time I need some bombs so I can blow shit up. That is not nice. Oh, I guess I gotta like shoot that out. There we go. It's over this way. They thought I wouldn't go find this door. Little did they know. Whoops. What have we here? What have we here? Hello. <laughs> Is it me you're looking for? Found some missiles, yay! Good for you. Thanks, buddy. You're just such a big boy now. <laughs> <laughs> or big girl, I guess, because Samus is a female. Alleg allegedly. Allegedly. We've seen no proof of that. There we go. Oh, I can get in there now. I forgot I got missiles. I wonder if Sam has had any children. And I don't if know. It, if so, would they be half alien? I mean, you know they would have made a game around it. Oh, yeah. Oh, more missiles. So I, I just used five missiles to 
go get five more missiles. You're right. Is that exactly what happened? Yep, that's exactly what happened. Yeah. All right. Let's see if we can get to that the first real kind of boss before I end for today. Boss time. Going up that elevator. That elevator, though. Elevador. <laughs> oh, oh god, there's enemies now. And they got missiles. They got so many missiles. And I remember, you know, in the Metroids, like, Samus would have to go down these very narrow, like, I don't know, column-like hallways. And if Samus was obese than a mofo, she wouldn't have worked. Fit down him. I mean, she could have rolled, maybe. That wouldn't have been very fun. Like a big old Goron. Big old Goron. And Goron. They Speaking were, of, we're going to have to do some Zelda games for this chamber at some best. point. You know that. Gorons were very orange. Dude, I remember us spending hours playing uh, Majora's Mask. Yeah, that was a good one. That was a good one. You don't like Majora's Mask. You're essentially a communist. Basically. Majora's Mask almost... I, I've still been thinking about it, but it almost convinced me in and of itself to buy a DS. Oh, yeah. A 3DS. 3DS, sure. Yeah. But that would have cost money. Yeah. yeah. Money's scarce these days. I got other stuff I'm trying to pay for. Yeah, like, you know, pets. I don't, I don't have a pet. But you could. I could. With your money. You still thinking about getting a dog? No, I'm not gonna get a dog. You were thinking about it. Out of control. You're out of control. All these damn critters. I would like to get a pet squirrel. Oh yeah? That I could sick on my enemies. Well, that's, that's important. Yeah, yeah. When you have a lot of enemies, it's tough to live. Oh, yeah? And you know who else has a lot of enemies? Samus! <laughs> that's true. Got a bunch of alien enemies. I'm just always so confused how she can stay alive. I know, right? Oh, I hate these things. Oh my shiz. Give me that life. Yeah. I needs it. Mm. So let's see what's going down this way. Hmm. What is this? Oh, I remember this. Map data access completed. Thank you. I'll take that map. I'm not even going to fight these guys. They annoy me. Don't fight them. I'm not going to. So, um, what, what kind of information are you thinking you're going to get posted today on your... Trump Harry Potter feed, sir. Depends on how the debate goes. Yeah. And um, it's gonna be funny. I mean, you know, it's basically a reality show with uh, with all this nonsense going on. It really is. Trump. I mean, Donald Trump, he, he doesn't care. He doesn't care. <laughs> he doesn't. That's the thing. I mean, he has a 40-something year old foreign wife who's a supermodel. He doesn't care. He's Donald Trump. Have you seen his hair? Yeah, I mean, he's essentially got what he wants out of life. It's outrageous. I mean, it's outrageous. Uh, I shouldn't. I just took damage to get a missile. Yeah. If that's not needy, I don't know what it is. Well, I mean, that is what many hookers do. They take damage to get those missiles. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Trying to get at them missiles. <laughs> I mean, you gotta get them if you want the money. But uh, really, you gotta get the money up right. front. Yeah, I mean, that's important. If you don't get the money up front, you're just bad at your job. First rule of hookerdom. Workplace violence will ensue. Alright, let's see what's down here. I found a save point. Oh, 
I am Samus, god of galactic destruction. Ah, would you die? Oh my god, there's so many of them. Hmm. Uh-oh, I think I found that boss. And I got bombs. But that boss, though. I think I found that boss. Dead boss. Yep, definitely found that boss. Oh, All right. Oh, man. Let's do this. And I can't see myself at all. Take him on. Take him on. The trick is, I have to just be okay with taking damage. You gotta take it like a bitch. Because, ultimately, he'll start shooting shit at me that I can get life off of. If I can survive that long. Nice. I have one life, dude. Oh, there it is. It's over. Whoop, there it is. Whoop, there it is. All right. Well, it's going to put me back at the save point, which isn't far. So I'm going to try the boss one more time. Um, and if I don't beat him this time, we'll cut the video now and we'll take care of it later. But, uh, yeah. We are. I think this time I'm going to switch to rockets when I try to fight him. Yeah, you might want to switch to rockets. Try to speed up that damage a little bit. My little Metroid -y gun isn't really cutting it. That gun sucks. It doesn't suck. It's just there are better. I mean, it quintessentially sucks. Just comparatively speaking, more than anything else. Oh wait, that was down here, that's right. All right. All right, we're gonna morph ball and slide. All right, not a single one of them hit me. No hits. <laughs> Got those bombs again. What I'm actually going to do is... I'm going to save the state here just to be safe. We'll put that in slot 9 so I don't get that confused with Castlevania. True that. I like right, those confusions. Go. Come at me. There we go, now he's shooting out the things that give me health. And some rockets, we got a couple rockets. Oh, he's almost dead. I killed him. Got that Nice. Bitch. Win that war. Yeah. JL I laid time. all his health. All right, so I got my bombs. I'm going to run back to the save point. Mm. We'll call it mm. quits for now. Check mm. out the save point. Check, Checking check, out that save point. Check out the save point. And we're going to try to roll past all these bats because they're oh, annoying. You shall go to prison. Grandma's this thing where he's constantly telling me I'm going to go to prison. It's because you constantly screw up. If you keep screwing up, you will eventually. What am I screwing up? I'm gainfully employed. <laughs> and the fact that you don't know what prison even is is. I alarming. do know what prison is. Like most Americans do. It's and a most place Americans we all don't. do our best to never go. They'll find themselves. I in say that there are many of us that do not do our best to not go. Right. <laughs> like the band Partial Cinema. Oh, 
Oh no, I want that rocket. It's so high up. I got it. Because I got ups. You're not. You can't play basketball. Uh, I beg to differ, sir. Different. We played basketball on the same Sam team. Samus, not you, Samus. Oh, fair enough. Word. All right, so I'm saving the game. And uh, so we're going to go ahead and call it here. Thank you for checking out Blow Out That Cartridge again. This was Super Metroid, and I think we're going to continue on this one for a little while, but I'm going to try to bring back Super Castlevania 4. It's just, it's, it's not one of those skills that's in my wheelhouse, so i got to get some practice in before we really continue. In that wheelhouse. But, um, Graham, thank you again for joining us. Yep. He will At be here for a lot of videos. He's got a lot of free time yes, um, so much. when he's not being Trump Harry Potter. Yeah. Uh, some videos he won't, and we regret to inform you that that's the case. But yeah, Give me money. <laughs> yeah, if I start paying him, I'm sure he'll be here all the time. Yes. Much but anyway, uh, we appreciate everybody watching. Thank hope you. hope everyone has a wonderful night. And, Gracias. Um, like, comment, subscribe again, all that shit that we're all asking you to do. I swear on Twitter I got 15 messages today asking me to subscribe to channels. and The S word. And I did. And the thing is, that's how YouTubers continue doing what they're doing. Um, all I ask in return is that they subscribe back to me. So I ask you, subscribe to me. Um, but that's enough for that. So we are going to wrap up now. And um, yeah, we'll see you in the next video. Adios.